Hi guys. Hey guys. So today is another trip to Tagum City. I hope that we can really see the doctor today. Yeah, hopefully. Well, they're, they're open, so hopefully we can get in. Yeah, that's why we're gonna leave a little early so we can be there on time. For and for today's uh, Dennis uh, outfit, let's check it out. Oh God! <laughs> you look very nice, honey. Oh, thanks. Your shoes very Thank nice. You. Very Thank nice. You. you look so good today. And today's weather is very sunny and okay. very bright. Yeah. Quick weather report. <laughs> yeah, about 74 degrees right now. Very low humidity, so it's very comfortable here. Yeah. No clouds in the sky. Well, way over there a little bit, but mm -hmm. uh, supposed to be clear and probably hot this afternoon. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, it's time for us to go now. Okay, let's go then. <laughs> So we are here now. Hopefully we can get in. Actually we're a little early, honey. There you know it's not even nine yet. Yeah, I know well. Maybe we can be first in line. Well maybe we should get something to eat first. Breakfast. No? Are you hungry? Well, a little bit, but not that hungry. I don't we should check and see what's going on first. Okay. We can always leave and go get something to eat. Alright. Maybe we can fill out something yeah. first. So now he's saying that the doctor is not gonna be here at 11. So what I'm gonna do is wait for the secretary so I can fill out something. And my God, it's not even nine o'clock yet. And goodness, I did not have Dennis climb up here. And all the stairs he should just come here when uh, the doctor is here oh my god I just need to wait for the secretary I guess okay so I I went there so the secretary is not there mm -hmm. and then uh, I go when is, is she gonna be here and she go and then she goes, uh, I think 10. And then the security guard there said like 9. And the doctor is not going to be there until, until 11. The reason why we came here early because we want to be in line first. But it's just that yesterday the secretary. Told, hmm? yeah, yesterday he told us 9 o'clock. You know, 9 o'clock. Yeah. Now 11. The doctor is going to be there. Yeah. This is a joke. Do you wanna get something to eat now and then go to the the, fir the other place that we went yesterday? Yeah. And then if if it's still it's a long line, then we are gonna have yeah. to come back in here. Try something else. It's very creepy in there. You know where you go to that uh, yeah. stairs and then the exit. Uh -huh. It's very scary. Really. It's very what? dark. What? Very oh. uh like I don't know. It's hmm. like a ghost. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, oh maybe goodness. it's the ghost of all the patients that died waiting to get in. <laughs> I guess we need to get something to eat now yeah. so it will give us some energy. Yeah. <laughs> so, we are at this place. We went to a different place. Yeah, I know we only have three people ahead of us here. Yeah. A little better. So and we the have... receptionist and the doctor was in. Yeah. So we're just gonna have to patiently wait for a few people ahead of us. It looks like they have a heart doctor in here. The what? Heart doctor. Yeah. So hopefully they will see you soon. Finally, after two hours of dealing in here at this place, we finally got an answer. But the good thing is we finally found somebody that knows what they're talking about. Yeah, it's not the ear. The, he thinks it's because of his uh, two bad uh, yeah. teeth and that making it the, the nerve. It's not your ear that's uh, like hurting, yeah, right. but it's 
the nerve from your teeth connected to w near your ear. Yeah. That's what's causing the pain. Yeah, causing the pain, the mm. radiation or something. So now he so recommended. Now we know. Yeah, we re he recommended this uh, dentist here, and. Um, have the tooth pulled? Yeah, have your teeth pulled. If yeah. if it's not today, then maybe at least we can make an appointment, you know? Yeah, well, we've gone to a dentist before. Why he did, she didn't see that? I don't know. Wow. So now, that's what we're gonna do. Check with the dentist, okay? Yeah. All yeah. right. So we've been roaming around looking for this, this dentist. We found some sign in here that has their number they don't answer i don't know where this dentist <laughs> oh my god maybe either. you don't have to go to this particular dentist well, this no, is the, I don't have to. yeah this is the dentist that the doctor uh recommended but i don't think we have to go exactly to that dentist no. at least we know that you, there's a problem in your teeth and that's that is what probably causing it so yeah well at yeah. least that's good to know after six months of nobody coming up with an answer at least now i know yeah so i guess we're gonna go home yeah i'll go home and uh find a find a dentist yeah so i just went in there we are actually back in town now nabunturan and then stop we stopped by here at this dentist uh where dennis always go and uh the secretaries talk to the dentist and said that you need to have a certification from the doctor because uh, he, she wanted to make sure that your sugar is not very high before she's gonna pull your teeth so it looks like we're gonna have to go to the doctor first before she will do anything so what do you wanna do like we need to go to the doctor well not today because you already eat mm -hmm. and you know they're gonna take your sugar take it to the doctor and see if a uh, certification from a doctor see if you're good to whatever Ooh, what can we do honey that's what we have that is what we have to do yay yay <laughs> thank god we are home safe and alive like yeah. every time we get home i always say thank you lord for making me uh live again another day <laughs> Whenever I go to the dent, uh, whenever I go uh, somewhere and I came back, uh, like okay, because it is very dangerous to go anywhere. Yeah, in we didn't have any close calls today, though. We don't have. No, no, we were well, very lucky, very, uh, very mild to drive. Amazing. Yeah. <laughs> Honestly, we almost give up. We actually almost went home after we went back to that place that uh, the first place we went this morning and uh i just you know told dennis just give this another place a try like yeah. the one we went to yesterday well, and, well, we did. and yeah we did so now we know what happened yeah a good doctor in there too man he answered a lot of questions and now we have a new direction to go to yeah. uh get rid of the pain in my ear and yeah know. and it's very cool that he ha he has this uh, machine where you can actually see the video of what's you know causing you know what's happening right. in your ear what how your yeah. ear looks like and everything take a picture of it and then put it on the screen so you can see yeah it's yeah, very, very cool huh very cool yeah i'm just really hoping honey that that that's what it is it's your teeth yeah well it looks like it i mean the whole root root is exposed, exposed. yeah so what he said made sense okay hi guys so i just got back from the market and from the store to get some milk and to get some vegetables from the market and then i also got some chicken breast because i'm gonna you know we've been like craving for uh some vegetables so that's why i'm gonna cook some vegetables for me and dennis and um dennis is just there in the bedroom resting right now he's still uh still recovering i mean he's not as bad as like uh it, it, when it started but uh he's still recovering little by little you know he had it bad this time the flu i know before he was uh also feeling like that but this time it's just taking him long to like sometimes he's okay and there's a uh, time in the day where you know he 
gets like uh, you know like no energy and I don't know that and tomorrow we are going to the doctor also I hope that uh, everything is fine test his uh, blood sugar and everything so anyway I'm gonna start cutting up all the uh, some of these vegetables so I got done chopping up all the vegetables here oh <laughs> I forgot this there's a couple of ones here I need to cut up and I want to add a little tomatoes maybe just to give a little weirdness uh, flavor <laughs> but I just thought that the tomatoes maybe will add uh, some sort of flavor in it because you know this recipe just to let you know it's just my own my own version I don't I'm not following any recipe from whoever and whatever <laughs> it's just me I just feel like really cooking vegetables and chicken breast and here's some of the chicken breast I actually still have a leftover maybe for uh, next time I didn't put it all I guess uh, I also need to pick up some um, pepper from the yard oh the sun is the sunset right now guys uh, very bright sunset uh, pick up uh, pick up some of the pepper here see this pepper we have look at this guys they're not very big but at least it's fresh from the yard organic this is enough for now and I'm gonna start cooking very soon I just put the garlic and the onions of course I put a little uh, oil in it and then now I'm gonna put the chicken put the chicken in it then I just added the tomatoes this is just some experiment recipe guys nothing in particular just whatever comes to mind smelling good now guys I'm gonna put just a little water little bit I just added the vegetables and then uh, a few minutes after this I'm gonna put the bell pepper and actually I am using this uh, oyster sauce just to add some flavor also I don't know if it's gonna turn out good but I'm hoping it's gonna turn out good <laughs> And this is all cooked, guys. So, smells so, so delicious. I'm gonna uh, wake Dennis up now because he's asleep. So, we can eat dinner now. I had to run outside because the water guy just came. And I also saw that they put the our water bill there by the gate so our water bill for this month is 319 that's not too bad it's like six dollars very good i wish the electricity is also as close as this <laughs> not like 200 dollars but oh well we you know we're using actually a lot of ac these days because it it's so hot and uh, especially if we stay in the bedroom during the daytime we also s turn on the AC and it's we turn on the AC also all night so there you go okay honey it's the time to try the meal oh wow it looks very nice very delicious and very healthy I don't think I put enough salt though it's probably all right try it mm. Oh, very good. This is an experiment. There's no recipe. Mm -hmm. Meat and vegetables? Yeah, well, chicken breast. Oh. You know that, I know the 
it doesn't mean that you're eating chicken will be healthy because it depends on the part of the chicken if you eat the the leg the thigh that's where there's a lot of fats in it mm -hmm. but the chicken breast which is the meat that i bought because you don't even eat uh, any kind of uh, meat from the chicken only chicken breast yeah so thank you baby very good you're welcome I'm glad you like it. Yeah, very nice meal tonight. For a change. <laughs> well, very nice dinner. Thank you. You're welcome. We forgot to say, let's eat, guys. Let's eat, guys. <laughs> Are you hey. okay, honey? <laughs> yeah, I'm fine. I'm trying to cover you. <laughs> yeah. Only your head show up. Right. <laughs> Actually, my mom... Uh, Maribin and Samuel are coming here. They're riding with Samuel. I was texting with them and I said, Yeah, Dennis is fine. He's just still, uh, you know, a little recovering. weak and recovering. And they're all like concerned and just worried. Mm. So, oh, he needs to do what? What does he need? Oh, maybe we need to go over there and check yeah. on him. Yeah. So, actually, we're just there. They should probably be here like in any time soon. I told them you guys don't have to come here tonight. What can you do? And I, I should have not mentioned. Cause I go, yeah, Dennis have a little temperature again. Oh. That was a uh, wrong because they were now they're all concerned. They're changing clothes and now they're coming yeah. here late. They shouldn't be doing it. Getting out this late at night. There's nothing they can do. But I appreciate their effort. Well, I, I well, me too. I really appreciate their concern and effort and. Yeah. Actually, my mom and Samuel are just coming back tonight and Maribin is gonna stay. Oh, wow. So we will also have a company, right. we'll have, you know. But um, right. of course, I'm worried about you also, honey. I'm very worried about you. That's why I just tell them like what's happening. Maribin's coming over because it takes two people to carry a body. <laughs> <laughs> Don't say that, honey. I, you know that I'm already very worried about you. I just, it even makes my stomach sick sometimes. Well, fine. This stuff, I don't know what it is, man, but this stuff really hangs on for a long time. You feel better in the morning, and then by the afternoon it comes around, you feel, feel like you're getting it again. So. Yeah, that's what I see you, honey. Like in the morning, huh? you're all like, good morning, yeah. honey, like that. Like uh, you always greet me whenever yeah. I go out there by the door. You're all like energetic and... You know, happy, and then in the afternoon, then you start getting sluggish again, and you know. Yeah, I don't know, man. It's just can't shake it, but I'm sure I will eventually. Just hanging on for a long time. I need to go out there because they All are right. gonna be here any time soon. Okay. I think they are here. Ay, mayong gabi ida Samuel. So they are here. That Samuel, where's uh, there's Maribin. Evening, guys. Uh, oh, you guys evening. came here. Good evening. Mayong gabi. That's why I greeted someone. It's late already and they are here because they were very concerned. And we were just all having a chica chica here for the last hour and a half. And then we heard a big thunderstorm. So now they are, they want to go home now before it's going to rain. Samuel and my mom are going home and Maribin is staying and uh, I guess they need to go before it starts raining so thank you so much guys for coming here coming over bye bye <laughs> bye, bye, -bye. <laughs> <laughs> and they already left I'm gonna check out I'm gonna check out what Maribin brought here or what they brought uy pagod nasunog malagi how come it's burnt? Balanghoy, guys. Balanghoy or cassava. No, no. Sila may nagluto, Ana. Saan mo na? Idukot ba duk? Ang siya inong. Burn. What is it? Nibulay sir. Ah, nibulay sir. Kasi kuha nun siya. It's actually this. Actually, the burnt is, it smells very good. This is very good when you dip it into salted fish, but I don't have salted fish, so anyway guys that will be it for our video today the the twist of <laughs> day like them coming over here unexpectedly late at night because uh they were just concerned and worried for dennis i keep checking with him and 
you know, uh, it seems like his temperature is gone now. And uh, tomorrow we're going to see the doctor. Thank you so much, guys, for watching another video today. And thank you for all your nice comments and all your well wishes for Dennis. We really appreciate it. And we will see you guys again tomorrow. Bye, guys. Bye, guys. Bye-bye. Good night. Good night.